माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई एम कौशल किशोर ठाकुर नाज टीचर ऑफ ज्ञान निकेतन इन प्रीवियस क्लास वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट फ्रैक्शंस नाउ टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट टाइप्स ऑफ फ्रैक्शंस द टाइप्स ऑफ फ्रैक्शंस दैट इज इक्विवेलेंट फ्रैक्शन A given fraction and the fraction obtained by multiplying or dividing its numerator and denominator by the same non-zero number are called equivalent fractions. Suppose that one by two is given. To find out the equivalent fractions of one by two, so we should multiply one by two into two by two to get two by four. Multiply by three by three to get three by six. Multiply by four by four to get four by eight. So we say that if we multiply or divide to its numerator and denominator by the same non-zero number, are called equivalent fractions. Now, next fractions is like fractions. In like fractions. Fractions having the same denominator but different numerator are called like fractions. Here, example is one by nine, two by nine, four by nine, five by nine. My dear boys, you see here the denominator of all fractions are same nine 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 nine, but numerator is different one two four five. So these are called like fractions. Due to denominator, same. Now, next topic is unlike fractions. Fractions having different denominators are called unlike fractions. Here, as for example, two by three, three by four, five by six, etc., are called unlike fractions. Why? Because here the denominator are different. Here the denominator three, four, six. Which is different, so these are called unlike fractions. Now, we have discussed changing unlike fractions to like fractions. How can we change unlike fractions to like fractions? First of all, the question is <coughs> to change unlike fraction. Like fractions. As for example, one by two, two by three, two by three, and three by six is given, which is unlike fractions. First of all, we take LCM. Of denominator, denominator. That is two, three, six. Two one ja two three, two three ja six, three one one one. L C M. So two two into three. That is six. So we change. One by two. Now, one by two is converting as same denominator six. We should try to convert these denominators as six. So, one by two is equal to one by two multiplied by to find to get six. We should multiply by three by three. That is three by six. Two by three. Is equals to two by three multiplied by two by two to get denominator six. So it is written as four by six. Now three by six, three by six. No three by six here. We take five by six. Five by six. Five by six. So this is already. Denominator is six, 
So we should multiply one by one. That is five by six. So one by two. Therefore, one by two, two by three, five by six is written as is written as as like fraction. 3 by 6, 4 by 6, 5 by 6. Here we see that the denominator of all the fractions are 6. So these fractions are called like fractions. Now, next topic is comparing quantity. Suppose that A by B, A by B, and C by D. Comparing quantity. Compare. Quantity. Here, A by B and C by D are given. We can find which is greater, which is smaller, or which is equal to. If by cross multiplication, multiplication, if A by B, C by D, if AD is greater than BC here AD by cross multiplication AD is greater than BC then A by B is greater than C by D first case second case if AD is less than BC then A by B is less than C by D. Third case, if AD is equals to BC, then A by B is equal to C by D. Here, first of all, we multiply cross multiplication. A multiply D and B multiply to C. And observe that if A by B is greater than C by D, then AD is greater than BC. If AD is less than BC, then we say that A by B is less than C by D. If AD is equals to BC, then we say that A by B is equal to C by D. Now, Next topic is comparing quantity more than two fractions. Maybe ascending order, maybe descending. My dear students, you can see this process can be done only two numbers. Because here, if we have more than three numbers, as for example, comparing, comparing, more than more than two numbers numbers then we convert in like fraction As for example, 1 by 2, example 1 by 2, 3 by 5, and 4 by 10. 
in these examples how can we find which is larger which is smaller so first of all we change it into like fractions first of all we change it into like fractions so we take lcm of 2 5 10 that is lcm is equal to 10 the lcm of 2 5 10 is 10 so 1 by 2 is written as 1 by 2 multiply by 5 by 5 is equal to 5 by 10 3 by 5 is equal to 3 by 5 into 2 by 2 is equal to 6 by 10 and 4 by 10 is equal to 4 by 10 multiplied by 1 by 1 that is 4 by 10 so we so we can here write 1 by 2 3 by 5 4 by 10 equals to 5 by 10 6 by 10 and 4 by 10 Now we see layer 4 by 10 is smaller and 6 by 10 is greater. Therefore, 4 by 10 is smaller and 6 by 10 is greater. In ascending order, we can write here 4 by 10, 5 by 10. 6 by 10 plus that 4 by 10 4 by 10 5 by 10 5 by 10 1 by 2 imply that 6 by 10 3 by 5 my dear students uh, next topic is discussed in next class thank you